everyone, and welcome back to Paula! And we are continuing my adventures as a vacationing nomadic giraffe, wandering through this beautiful world, being completely and utterly blown away by the amazing creations that people have already put in here. I cannot believe how much this server has grown! It is amazing! This world, this world, this world, my friends. Oh my gosh. This world built by my friends is just... I don't even I don't even have the words. I I'm still recovering from seeing this beautiful tree yesterday. Oh my gosh. Like uh I just uh this is amazing. This is amazing. My birds are on top of that tree. This is such a beautiful place and my little finches are up there and I have a whole bunch of delicious chocolate in my pockets and there's frog spawn that I could spawn in some little frogs or I could trade it for some coins and I am just so happy right now. I am so happy right now, guys. This is truly inspirational. I mean, look at this room. I feel like this room alone would have been enough to blow me away, but the fact that the room continues to go, you have this really cool little ledge. It just, yeah, and it takes you to more places to explore. This is everything my little exploring heart could possibly desire. Look, and pumpkin my finch was just peeking up over the edge of that tree. I absolutely love this. But yes, so my vacation with Chips in real life is continuing as we are visiting with his family in North Carolina for spring break this year. And so I thought we'll continue on for the duration of my real life vacation. Do you like that rhyming there? Or I should have said alliteration. It would have been three things. Dang it. All right. I'll practice my poetry punk style little rhymes in the future. Uh, but yes, so we are going to continue to wander this world. Right now, I am still in the nomadic journey stage, but I am quickly becoming resolved to find a biome to call my very own where we can build all sorts of crossover projects. Just think how cool that would be. Wolf quest projects, an entire star stable, like horse stable. It would be so much fun. And I've been told, you know, come here, come here. That rumor has it that if I go to the cat cafe, I may very well stumble upon some familiar faces. Or should I have said familiar faces? Gosh darn it, Siri, you are just missing all these opportunities for, for rhymings and puns. Ugh, clearly, I need to work up a little bit of an appetite and eat some of this refreshing food I have collected. But for now, let's continue touring this place, which is actually like a hidden underground garden that I accidentally fell into when I slipped into a waterfall while chasing down frog spawn. Quite the story, it's been amazing. Uh, but there's a path here. Okay, and we went down here. This is a really cute little spot where another Butters the Squirrel is hanging out. I cannot believe that somebody made this beautiful garden dedicated to Nutter Butters from our squirrel rescue in Zoo Crafting. I, I'm blown away by all of the little references to our series I'm finding. I think like my joy journal is open and lying next to me right now because I keep stumbling on things that make me stop and have to like scribble down in my joy journal. That's what we call and my household emergency joy journal time and it cracks chips up when we hug and do something sweet and the next thing I go is like joy journal to me I need to write this down and he just he just bursts out laughing apparently most people don't like keep such strict records of joy just imagine that imagine what Ooh, ooh imagine that what is this what is this it's a little hidden tunnel I like the amount of leaves in here I'm highly <gasps> oh my gosh, you're kidding me. Oh my gosh, you guys, you guys. Look at this, this, I'm, I'm taking screenshots. I'm taking screenshots. I have got to have, what, a, like a travelogue. <gasps> I'm going to have a serious travelogue of Pela. Oh, that's just so exciting. I have to figure out how I'm going to like show all of the pictures to you guys. But this is, this is like not a one-off thing. Hopefully the server will be around for as many years as zoo crafting will be around, which is the rest of my life, if you ask me. And I'm just, I just, I just, Mmm, I know exactly what those things are. I know exactly what those things are. I should show them to you guys because they look really confusing at the moment 
And uh, all I'm going to say is that let's just say that these are sneak peeks and previews of a certain custom mob that I had commissioned for a, um, a completely amazing roleplay series that hopefully you'll see this summer. That's how big it is. I am working on it for the summer. And I allowed uh, the, the wonderful Pela group to have access to this exclusive mod that was specifically commissioned by me. Uh, this is a very unique creature that only exists in the mod files that I have and may I introduce to you my friends if I can just gently let's nudge you this way my little one just for a second just for a second I just need to get a good look at you may I introduce you to the hamster corn that's right guys that's right it's a hamster corn. It's a hamster corn and they come in a variety of colors, but they are actually an exclusive mod that I had made for a very, very special uh, modded Minecraft roleplay series that, uh, there you go. You guys just got the secret sneak peek of, but yeah, so Pele gets to play with it because I couldn't help myself and wanted to share it with everybody. It's adorable. It is, it is a mod that you can ride, but these guys are not tamed. And uh, let's just say something interesting happens if it gets hit by lightning. So. Yes. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. They're so cute. And they're here in a hidden tunnel. This hidden tunnel thing, I like want to convert every single cave system I run into into something this cool from now on. Because this feels like it followed a natural cave system. Um, and look at these lanterns. Look at these lanterns. These are amazing. And there's so many leaves. Why do I not put more leaves over my head in all of the things that I do in my life? In fact, I should put some leaves over my head in real life here too. <gasps> Sunflowers, look how beautiful. And this birch tree, oh wow. Look at this bridge. Oh my gosh, I love how it just swirls down under this log here and the lights change colors. I could have a picnic every day in a different garden here. This is the best hot springs ever. Forget my little mud cafe I used to have. This is this is amazing. You could eat with hamster corns. You could wander through these tunnels and just accidentally bump into like undiscovered rooms. I'm completely lost. Oh, that's right. Okay, so we went down there and now, I mean, look at how big this place is. Is it just an endless labyrinth of gardens? Because if this is literally what I spend the rest of my time here doing for many months, I mean, just watch, I'll adventure here and then get lost and have to leave and then come back and then people will have just added more. They could keep me eternally trapped in a labyrinth of gardens. <gasps> I need to write that down. That would make an amazing book series, actually. The eternal labyrinth of gardens. Holy days. That would actually be kind of amazing to read about. All right, so where are we going now? Oh, I heard a noise. Hello? This dirt is following. Oh, oh! Honesty is over my head. That, that actually sounded really profound when I mean actually the character honesty, uh, which is quite fascinating. And here's a whole bunch of the miner's flowers. And Davina, a miner! Oh my gosh, I'm outside. Wow! Well, here I was talking about going on into the eternal labyrinth of gardens and I actually popped out. Is this the mine that- oh, <gasps> Miner's Delight! What is, what'd she say? Uh, could you get these plants out of here? Oh my gosh, yeah, I don't mind. Yeah, get these plants out of here. Hello, Miner Davina. Do you- are you busy? I think she's just busy mining. But so she gives Miner's Delight, which is a pretty rare, hard to find uh, plant that you can find inside of cave systems. Don't mind if I do, Miner Davina. Don't mind me. I'm just gonna- okay, so she's just doing a little bit of mining over here. And then there's Garanth, another miner. And wow, so this is like an active mine system with a chicken. I, I approve of the chicken. I also approve of the minecart. That's pretty cool. So I wonder if we can talk to him. But wow, okay. Wow, and there's Groff, a stonemason, and there is another set of chickens. There's a few chickens wandering. Oh, and there's a, um... Okay, then. <laughs> there's another flying wolf. That's fine. This is hilarious. I don't know why there are so many flying wolves here. Apple Forest has a lot to answer in terms of its mysteries, uh, but is this is that is that the end of the hot springs? Because I don't mind. I just have some frog spawn to turn in. It's the very first thing I have that can make me some money, so I do want to head back over and turn in the frog spawn. So that was down to so that was down to the beautiful sunflower garden, and then this is up again. 
Whew, we're closer to the surface than I thought. Okay. What? I heard goats, but I see beautiful, beautiful ice crystals. Oh my gosh. I could really just come down into the endless labyrinth of gardens. I wonder, I wonder if it'll just keep like growing. I wonder if they'll let me keep growing it. Like just come down and continually expand the gardens over time. <gasps> what if I, what if I make that one of my goals? To go through the world and gather up some rare flowers and then fill up room after room after room down here with rare flowers. Oh, that would be so cool. Oh, now I want to write a book and everyone's been telling me lately, Sierra, yeah, you should try writing a book. And then I start cackling wildly and going, with what free time? <laughs> but I don't know, that would be kind of fun. All right, here's my birds right over here. All right. Okay, I think I'm starting to figure out the path. And just like in real life, the more I walk around somewhere, the less lost I become. But give me directions and I am going to end up completely in the wrong place. Th that is why Chips, I mean, if you watch the vlogs, you don't see him, but he was like pale and sweaty with fear every time I was loosed upon the, like Taiwan and can't speak any Chinese. It was, it was quite entertaining, uh, except for the fact when I would actually possibly get lost. But what is going on here? Wait a second, is that another? <gasps> Look, there's another path over there and it takes you to another garden. How many gardens are in this endless labyrinth of gardens? This is fantastic. More gardens, more. <gasps> a rainbow oak garden. What was that? Why did it make so much noise? It's a, it's a hummingbird. It's a tiny hummingbird. Oh my gosh, that's beautiful. Oh my gosh, it's full of hummingbirds that match the leaves. <gasps> this is so beautiful. Oh my goodness. There's something growling. I don't know how I feel about the growling part of things. Is it because of this dark patch right over here? Can I peek? Okay, I don't know how I feel about that, but oh my gosh, this is so cool. There's so many little hummingbirds. If you put a little hummingbird nest in, will they have little hummingbird eggs in there? Oh, there's another one! Hidden hummingbirds everywhere. Imagine a fun little quest to send somebody to gather like little little feathers from the hidden hummingbirds. That would be so cute. Oh my gosh. I love this room. I love this. I Love this! This is the best vacation ever. Oh my goodness. <laughs> and I, we can come back here in the future. Oh my gosh, this is so stunning. I can't even describe how relaxing this is too. All right, so let's see. I think I walked up. Uh, oh, cherry blossoms. Forget being able to add anything to this. This is just, this is so beautiful. This is so beautiful. I just, I, I don't even know what to do. I don't even know what to do with myself. Is this what they call relaxation? I'm not very good at the whole vacationing thing. I literally have a list of things I want to build while I'm coming up with the ideas while on this vacation here in Pala. And I, I, I guess this is, do you just lay on the, the hammock and like close your eyes and be serenaded to sleep by the beautiful sounds of the secretary bird? Cause I'll accept that. I, I will. Oh my gosh. Oh, that's so cool. This is so beautiful. I will be back. I will be back. Watch all of our snail mill streams just be held while I sit inside of these rooms and and just admire them forever before opening up the, the mail. This is just too cool. So, oh, my little birds. Let's head over to the other side there and then we'll follow the cherry blossom path, which is always a promising thing to do in my opinion. And I love how there's just a tiny element of like lovely risk as you have to walk along all of this spot up here. It just reminds me so much of, like, a really stunning temple from Legend of Zelda, and I have no idea why. Okay, this... I made it. I was worried that leaf was going to prove my doom, and it would not be the first time I have died due to leaves. Uh, oh, there was a safer way to come around. Okay, then. <laughs> of course. <laughs> oh, my goodness. All right, let's head down here. And then wiggle, 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 my beautiful burros. Wiggle wiggle, and now where are we? Oh my gosh. Like an Alice in Wonderland. Ah, oh, ah, oh, this is so cool. It's a death flower. Oh my gosh. 
You could have so many ama amazing meetings. Like, just think about, oh, look at this. Look at this. Everything is so amazing. I cannot even handle how amazing this is. This is so cool. <laughs> look at the patterns. I have I have never been like I'm not I'm not a very good Minecraftian builder. I'm a great Minecraftian storyteller for my own interest, if not like the actuality. But this no Siri, you're on vacation, but I'm like literally expanding my to-do list of projects as I go and where am I now in flurry? That's what was dra like growling at me. It was a dragon, a wyvern even, excuse me. Oh my gosh. I have so much inspiration just bubbling over right now for what I want to do in in the friendship forest. This is just this is just flurry. You have an amazing home. You have an amazing home. An endless labyrinth of gardens. They need more benches so that I heard it. A door. <gasps> Senpai, I spy you with my little eye, senpai. <laughs> this is too cool. This is too cool. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's head over here. I, I, I don't even think we've seen all of the gardens yet either. And what if they keep growing? Like, that looks like a good spot to keep going. Oh my goodness. Wait, am I here? <gasps> That's the, this is the way out. I think I finally, I think I finally made a loop. I finally made a loop, you guys. Oh my goodness. I found the way out. <laughs> that was so cool. I am not even entirely sure if I saw all of the gardens down there that were possible to see. But but let me just come over here. Amelia, I will totally be back. Like, I want to host a whole tea party in there. That is just, that's ridiculous. I just need to like, oh, maybe, maybe. Maybe I should start a peach tea shop or just a little cute tea shop in general. Oh, no, I like I'm on vacation, but I can't help but come up with all these ideas because I guess I guess vacations are supposed to rejuvenate you and I'm feeling so creatively rejuvenated. That's for sure. All right. So now where am I? Let's go check on that frog again. So we managed my friends to get well and truly lost by that waterfall if 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 like this world has those kinds of surprises hiding in it <laughs> just like right around a corner did you know that was gonna be down there it was just a door like it wasn't even clear it was a door it was just a thing and it was wiggling and I was like what is that going on there and I poked it and the next thing you know I found one of the most precious and beautiful gifts that I think I have ever 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 had someone create for me and I'm sort of blown out of the water right now to say the least all right, let's wiggle over here. And now I'm gonna visit with this frog. Oh, here's a nice little bench that I could rest at. Oh, there's a whole bunch of the um, the Spanish moss over here too. Cause it's like a nice little mossy area for our frog friend. Thank you, frog friend. And that gives me three frog spawn. And we're not going to actually spawn these frogs. We're gonna come over and talk to Jade and she will now give me my very first bit of money! We finally have six stone coins that we have of our very own. <sighs> so I came to the hot springs and I kind of got a part-time job gathering frog spawn. <laughs> that sounds like a me thing to do. And the end result is that we actually have stone coins and wooden coins now. There's also a villager here that will give us apples, which is kind of cool. And I don't know what I would spend the money on just yet other than dog food. I do need to have a reliable source of income, even if I am a nomadic hippie giraffe, so that I can feed my dogs and bring Lily and Tate into this new world to begin sharing adventures with me and begin exploring it more so that we can start building our crossover botanical garden, which I'm very much looking forward to. And what is this? It is the fish shop. Oh, that would be exactly where Tate would absolutely love to go. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, there's fish. <laughs> there's fish. There's a little fish. I didn't even know that was a thing. Oh, that's so cute. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. It's Willie. Old Willie. How you doing? 
He's got raw fish, and he has got the fishing rods, actually. So a wooden fishing rod or an iron fishing rod. Uh, he's also got raw crab. Oh, you can give him jellyfish, raw crab, or raw frogs. <gasps> he's got a ship in a bottle. That is so cute. I want to buy a ship in a bottle. Oh, look, look, look. It's the fish bowl. Okay, I'm going to buy a fish bowl. I just bought a fish. I just committed myself to a fish. I don't even have a home yet. I'm going to put him in my room in the inn. <laughs> I'm gonna go. I'm, let's go put my fish in the room in the end. Oh, wait. I didn't finish exploring the little fish shop. Look at the nets. Oh my gosh, the trophies. Ah, oh, this makes me want to go back to the Tate and Tackle so badly. Maybe we can add in a little extension. Oh, that's so cute. Uh, well, I mean, the fish are dead, but you, you get the idea. But maybe I could add in a little extension of... I thought somebody was like hiding right here to kind of spy on me because they know I'm recording like in a sneaky fun way where we can laugh about it later in the discord and actually it's just a cute pigu hello cute pigu you're quite adorable I wonder if there's something mysterious and secretive about you too and what is that <gasps> oh, I think I know Kaylee I know Kaylee we adventured over there okay I think we are finally beginning to make some loops there's so much to explore that my mind is just spinning and we've hardly even begun to touch like the surface of what is here and what's available and there's a valentine's day event that i need to hurry up and do before it goes away and 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 what is that oh my gosh guys this is the best Whew. All right, our giraffe nomadic adventures whilst I vacation in real life. Adventuring and vacationing here in Paula will continue next time. For now, I actually have a, um, a fish, a fish that I am now responsible for and that I need to go put inside of my inn. And I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.